We're out on our CBSA back lot. We are leading into a beautiful weekend, Saturday and Sunday. No better time to get out to Little Italy for the Mission Fed Art Walk. Uh, we have Courtney Pendleton of Mission Fed Credit Union. Yes. Thanks for being with us this morning, Courtney. Thanks so much for having us. We have some artists as well that we're going to be talking with this morning and some artwork on display. But I want to start off with, of course, the big event this the weekend. big event. 39th annual. 39th annual. So it's one of the longest and, uh, you know, largest, um, longest running and largest arts festival in Southern California. Really, which is amazing, and Mission Fed's been a proud partner for 15 years of that. Um, but you know, we're just all about community and being able to be part of bringing this event to the community, the free community event um, that's family friendly too, with Kids Walk and all these other things. But it just gives San Diegans an opportunity to meet some of these amazing yeah. artists and buy art, purchase art, and really just be immersed in in the arts. Uh, already, Little Italy is such a fun place yeah. to kind of peruse and just walk around. Uh, tell people, do you have to buy tickets is this free can you just if you're in the neighborhood just mosey on over it is a free event and again we're so proud to to help make that possible yeah. as the sponsor for it um, but you know some people don't like to come to Little Italy maybe because they won't find parking yes the very cool thing about this year is the MTS trolley is offering free trolley that. tickets so just if you go to the art walk website uh, you'll be able to um, purchase or not purchase you'll be able to enter your email yeah. and get those tickets it's, and it's that simple I mean the trolley is so easy to yes. hop on hop off and it you can kind of make a whole day out of it get down absolutely. maybe get, grab some breakfast uh, enjoy some art some music too absolutely there's something for everyone and there's a kids walk too so bring the oh, little cool. ones okay. as well uh, let's take a look at some of the art that we have on display could you tell us your name um, yes my name is Jen all right Jen uh, tell us about your artwork that you have here um, so this is a new series that I've been working on um, I use a lot of watercolor ink and acrylic um, and yeah, I just wanted to kind of go with something bright and some nice ocean colors. And are these people that you know? How yeah. do you? Okay, so you just come up with it off yeah, the top have, of your head. Yeah, I do have reference photos, but okay. then I just kind of play around with it and change things up. And Super just, cool. Yeah, they uh, change frequently. Are you excited for this weekend? <laughs> I'm very excited. Very excited. I imagine it's just cool to talk with people who are buying your art, mm -hmm. talk about what they're interested in, and you've you've got a lot of stuff on display. Um, yeah, it's um, it's great, and San Diego's been an awesome area. In fact, yeah. uh, I recently moved here with oh, my welcome. family. Oh, welcome! Yeah, awesome. So, and been doing the show for seven years. So that's so cool. It's, it's a lot of fun, and everybody is always so friendly. And yeah, it's, it's really great. Well, we're gl glad to have you. Happy to have you here in San Diego, and excited for this weekend. And how about you? Tell us your name and, and about your artwork. Good morning. My name is Mac Hillenbrand. I do artworks out of wood, trying to capture the soul of local spots here in San Diego and reveal seascapes in the grain of boards that I come across, a lot of which are from trees that grew and fell in San Diego. This is so wild. How do, how do you do this? This is wood, right? Or yeah. tell us about yeah. like the, the process. These are all artworks out of wood. Essentially, I search for what I call boards of intrigue and try and reveal the fantasy surf breaks in the yeah, grain. That is so cool. This is lo essentially like looking at the coast, yeah. right? Yeah. So cool. Uh, so tell us about what you're excited for this weekend. Well, this is one of the best events that happens in San Diego. And as one of the featured artists, I'm very proud to present yeah. what I consider to be some of my best work I've ever done. Um, so I've been working hard. I'm really looking forward to showcasing the work, meeting the people. I have big, fancy pieces. I have little small pieces yeah. and all the artists work really hard for this this it's is going to so be a fantastic cool. time well very out. exciting yeah and then unlike we mentioned little italy already just a fun place to be but also to meet some artists courtney come on over with me we want to say hello to you as well all right that's nice. good to see you good to see you tell us your name and name what is, you're going to be doing this my weekend name is robin hankel and I've been playing uh, Art Walk for a long time. So long I forgot. <laughs> At least 20 years, though. That's amazing. It's always great. And, yeah. I mean, already, like we said, it's fun to just get around, walk around, enjoy the artwork. But you're going to provide a little bit of musical entertainment yes, for sir. everyone. Yeah, I'm at the corner of a beach in India today. How long have you been uh, playing music for? <laughs> <laughs> Has it been a long 62 time? 62 years. 62 years. Maybe All right. 63. I love it. All right. Well, we're excited for you to be playing music for us this morning and this weekend. Uh, Courtney, remind people where they can go for more information yes. uh, for all of that stuff. Yeah, Mission Fed Art Walk. Uh, look for the website there. One thing we didn't also talk yeah. about and one of the things that I think we love the most too is the, our charity partner is yeah. Art Reach San Diego. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. um, all of these beautiful custom oh, so cool. painted bikes, helmets, bells are all available at the ArtReachSanDiego.org website for bids. And what ArtReach does is bring um, the arts to schools and to children in schools. Um, arts education, really important, sometimes the least funded um, or most underfunded or maybe cut from schools, right? right. So being able to, to get the next generation of future artists involved it. and whatnot, um, all those proceeds will go back to ArtReach. Amazing.